You have lots of things. What else did you get? The meatballs. The meatballs. Are the meatballs just right for your hand? Yes. They are. are so the are you? Noodle? I don't know. Are the noodles just right for your hand? No. No, just the meatballs, right? Because the noodles would make it too what? Long. Big. Too long. They'd be too big. It'd be too long. What did you come up with that's just the right size for you? This. Okay, and is it just the right size for your hand? Yeah. How did you figure that out? What were you doing? How did you know? I was, I was just, I would just find it in a black area. And how did you know? What did you do to make sure that it was just the right size? Check. You checked. How did you check? What did you do? Did you put it on your ear? No. No. How did you know? Cause I just put it on my hand. Let's see. I think you did. Is it the right? Just the right size? Mm -hmm. Well, does it go from where to where? It goes from the bottom all the way up to there. Is that right? It goes from the from the bottom of your hand to the very top of your finger. I think it. To here. I think so. And I think that might be just the right size for you, Isaiah. Yep. All right. What about the um the cheese the cheese shaker? Is that the right size? Mm, yeah. It is. Did it go all the way from the bottom to the top? It just goes like that. So was it just the right size or was it a little bit different? It was just the right size. It was just the right size? Are those two the same size? But they're not big. They're not, one's longer, right? Which one is longer? That one. That is longer. So do you think that it's the same size as that one? So one's just right, right? Yeah, and is it the same, is it this one or this one? This one. That one, so that one must, is a little bit what? Small. Small, it's shorter than that, than your longer one, right? They understood that they needed to use the bottom of their hand to the top of their finger to actually compare the item to see if it was just right for them, the right size. But when I was asking a few of the children how do you know? It was kind of hard for them to articulate and to explain exactly what they were doing. And so I was trying to pull out the language of, well, how do you check? What do you do? How do you know? So giving them more experience and using that type of language more in the classroom, I think, will be also a good thing to focus on in the future.